Well, hello, 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 everyone out there in Terrorland. What's up, y'all? Peace, peace, peace. How you living? How you living? How you live? This is your girl, Zen Gaia, the Zen Libran. And welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel, Zen Libran Tarot. What's going on, y'all? I hope y'all doing good out there. I hope the day treated you well. I hope you were productive. And I hope you have peace, love, and joy in your life. Yeah. And we vibing high, y'all. We vibing high. You know what I'm saying? If this is the first time you, you're viewing my channel, I want to thank you for viewing me. Don't forget to hit that like button and the subscribe button at the bottom um, right-hand corner of the screen, guys. You know what I'm saying? Support the channel, guys. This channel is all about women empowerment. It's all about elevating the goddess to get back on her throne, you know? It's all about self-love. It's all about self-healing, you know? Um... Mother Earth is crying out for the divine feminists to take their place. Um, Earth needs us, you know. Uh, we were the original rulers that were designed to be here, to rule this earth, to bring guidance, counsel, and light to this earth. And the patriarch, when they came in power, where they took the throne, okay, um, we've been in total darkness ever since. Ever since the, the I want to say the end of the 18th dynasty, ever since uh, King Tut passed. And King Tut is a woman, mind you, okay? Um, it, that was the last of the royal bloodline that was right before um, the man, the human, which is the he-man, the man took the throne, okay? Um, and we need to go back to the golden ages, you know what I'm saying? It's time for this vibration of this planet to be lifted, and we are being called to take our place, all right? All right, child. Well, this is uh, the reading for Zodiac sign of Libra for the month of January. Now, what's going on with this Leo? <laughs> this Leo won his twin flame. He won his twin flame. She has been released from being contained, isolated, captured by him, I want to say in a sort. He's been keeping her in a tower, but she's been freed. Okay? And uh, he wants her. He don't want her to go nowhere. He don't want things to change, but, but things have changed. And she's free now. And uh, she's his wish fulfillment, and he can't have that, okay? That's what's going on with the Leo, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. And, of course, this is the Goddess Channel. I speak from the woman's aspect, and I pull from the feminine energy. And the feminine energy that I pull to help me deliver this message to my Leos is Satira. Satirists are giving us the energy of brazen. You're a very strong person. You're a very funny person. You do a lot of things with satire. I want to say you are a Hayoki empath. Um, you go against the grain. You don't follow the crowd. You're very unique and you stand out and you're very strong and people see your strength. Um, it's your aura, your energy. Um, you've had an epiphany. Um, about this, your twin flame doing these control tactics on you, trying to keep you and bind you to him, trying to, you know what I'm saying? Um, but you've had a breakthrough, and uh, you're coming into abundance and in prosperity. Yeah, yeah, even um, another relationship. You've been released from this contract from this uh, karmic twin, and... Uh, he don't want you to move nowhere. You know what I'm saying? But you strong, brazen, and you laughing at his ass all the way while you're doing your thing. You know what I'm saying? Um, this is Satira giving us the energy of brazen. Okay? <laughs> yes, 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 honey. You have a lot of peace in your life right now. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 you're, you're sitting at your home and you're chilling. And you have inner peace and you are connected and that's the number eight again you have a connection to the divine you have a spiritual connection to the divine and and, and they got you you know what i'm saying they got you. You, you you're peaceful even though you're at home you know what i'm saying you're peaceful you're in your sanctuary you're not being bothered with this uh masculine and he hates that you know what I'm saying? Because I don't know if he wants to partake in your abundance, but he wants his twin flame because he knows that he will get his wishes fulfilled with you. Okay? Um, this person is, um, he's guilty. Okay? 
He's guilty of trying to sabotage your platform. You have a platform, you do something in communication, and this person is guilty of trying to destroy that, to sabotage that. He's in his feelings because you won't be with him. You won't take his love off of So he decided to destroy your platform. This is a miserable, weak-ass bastard. You know what I'm saying? Um, he, he wants you to be in dire straits if you don't want to be with him. <sighs> Boy, this is a miserable, no good. But you, you, you good. You got your peace and you chilling. You connected and protected. Don't worry about it, okay? All right? I mean, this is a pitiful, ridiculous-ass bastard. You know what I'm saying? Ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? And he could do whatever he want to because you're about that life. You're going to stand your ground to his ugly ass. You know what I'm saying? So if you he, if he want to fight, let's get a fair one. Let's get our glove boxing gloves on. Let's get in the ring, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What he thought? You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Look at you. Trying to destroy your platform and you finna be seen across the world. You made it, honey. And ain't nothing that he can do to stop you. You know what I'm saying? You made it, honey. And this is going to bring you a lot of abundance. You know what I'm saying? And, and um, um, prosperity with his raggedy ass. You know what I'm saying? You coming into happiness, abundance, prosperity, and everything, honey. Yeah. You beat this fucker. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know what I'm saying? You triumph this person. Because, like I told you, you have a spiritual connected. And you have spiritual gifts also. So what he thought? You know what I'm saying? Coming up against a war with somebody chosen and you triumphed over his ass. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You having a new beginning. This person tried to steal what was meant for you. And it's meant for you to be in this field of communication. It's meant for you to be a star. You know what I'm saying? He tried to steal your new beginning and what you did? You stole your stuff right back. You know what I'm saying? He stole it from you and you went and took it right back. And you look good all while you was doing it. You know what I'm saying? A beautiful bandit. Girl, he was um, trying to um, siphon in your energy. So he, he's taking your star power. And you called your energy back. You know what I'm saying? And you putting all of it into yourself. You know what I'm saying? Not into him. You know what I'm saying? You finna have a new beginning. He tried to steal, steal what's meant for you and you stole it back. I mean, what do you think this is? You know what I'm saying? Keep telling y'all you're here. We're about that life. You know what I'm saying? This person is very immature. Very immature. You know what I'm saying? And we ain't got time for that, girl. He is so immature. It's just ridiculous. No, take your childish ass on. You know what I'm saying? This feminine, regardless of what this person is, she's moving further forward in life. She's going to have a well-balanced, well-organized life. She could even be having um, a new partner. She's going to have a new partner. Um, a relationship that practices reciprocity. You know what I'm saying? And um, um, he gives to her, she gives to him. She comforts him, he comforts her. You know what I'm saying? And they're going to be doing a damn thing together. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is her destiny. And this masculine just going to have to be mad. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He tried to contain her. He want to contain her, y'all. Trying to contain her. Trying to keep her back. Trying to keep her in the tower, girl. Please. You know what I'm saying? Look at him, y'all. Oh, no. She trying to get out and he trying to keep her. You know what I'm saying? Look at him. All in front of her. Pushing her back. You know what I'm saying? Get your ass on, man. She don't want you. You know what I'm saying? She don't want you, dog. You know what I'm saying? Go on. You know what I'm saying? Well, let's get this energy out here. Let's get the tarot out here. Let's see what the universe has to say about what's going on. With my Leo. <sighs> You're styling and profiling. I just heard that. <laughs> oh, I went back. <laughs> yeah, honey, everybody's going to see you across the world, honey. Yeah. This masculine really only wants pleasure from you. He only wants sex from you, really. That's all he really wants. I mean, he wants your energy. It's all about your energy. He wants to siphon your energy. So that's all he wants is sex because he wants to be a store of your energy instead of working on his own. <laughs> He'd rather steal yours. What he thought he did, you stole your stuff right back. You know what I'm saying? This is a person. Um, he wants you to surrender to him. This person is somebody he feels kind of. He's honored to be dealing with some, that he's dealt with someone like you. I mean, you would do something for his image because he over there looking bad. 
You know what I'm saying? All the bad things that he done did in life is taking toll on him physically now. His teeth over there falling out. You know what I'm saying? He done gained weight. His hair done fell out. I mean, he looks like a, a buzzard sitting on the fence. You know what I'm saying? Because he looks as wicked as he is in the inside. It's showing on the inside. And you see him exactly for what he is. You know the truth about this particular person, okay? Um, this person wants you to drop your... Your um, your God, um, because he wants to come in your life and use you for finances. <laughs> because you're seen all across the world, your platform is doing really, really well, and he wants a union with you because he wants to uh, reap the rewards of this fertility that you have. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he got his nerve, girl. Please get your pelican looking ass out of here. That's what he looked like—a pelican, y'all. He look like a damn warrus. Nobody want to get with you. You know what I'm saying? Don't nobody want to get with you. Because you, G-L-Y, you ain't got no alibi because you ugly. Yeah, you ugly. <laughs> You ugly, yeah, you ugly. <laughs> yeah, honey, this is your justice. You could be a Libra. You ain't trying to get with him. I know. Yeah, I'm a Libra, and we don't go back. Well, we're done. We're done. You know what I'm saying? So next time you deal with a Libra and you mess her around, watch it, because you know she's going to be done. Maybe you'll realize next time. Or just don't deal with a Libra, because if you're not right, your ass will get dumped and cut off and our cut off game is immaculate you hear what i'm saying we don't go backwards we don't give second chances okay <clears throat> all right y'all what we got out here what we got out here and this your twin flame boy please you know what i'm saying what's going on out here <laughs> girl you ended a cycle with this person you stop dealing with this person so he started doing all type of sneaky stuff behind your back this person is so immature this person was doing all type of stuff from behind your back trying to set you up get you in trouble with the law gang stalking you trying to get women to jump on you and all this stuff so he can just come around and be what happened but he done orchestrated the whole damn thing you know what i'm saying very immature just very toxic you know what i'm saying um this person was doing things behind the scene to uh attack you psychically attacking you behind the scene because you don't want to be with him but you're free from these psychic attacks now um this person wants to be in a commitment with you but only because you're abundant this is a person from your past that wants to reconnect um this person has an ego problem he's cocky and he's been exposed for what he is he's been exposed yeah mm -hmm. yeah this is a water sign this is a cancer um, that wants to move forward with you. He wants the uh, stability of moving into your home. Um, this person is having financial problems right now. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you don't care. You know what I'm saying? He's begging. Uh, but you're rejecting this person. You're rejecting this person. But he wants to just the stability and move forward with you. But it's not happening. You know what I'm saying? Um, he feels that if he can move forward with you, that he will have the victory. But you have clarity about this particular person. You're not interested. <laughs> <laughs> you're not interested you know what i'm saying you're not interested you know he want to move in with you you know he this is a person from your past you free from all this um sneaky stuff he was doing behind your back you're free so why go back you know what i'm saying you don't want to have a you know you don't want to deal with a person like this he's so immature he's so immature doing spell work attacking you and stuff because you don't want to be with him what you think would happen if you if you was to be with him and you did something that he didn't like? <laughs> this is a clown. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we don't deal with clowns. All right. Let's get some more energy down here before we close this off because we're not dealing with this food because this is a total jackass. You know what I'm saying? And want to be in a union with you because he want to partake of your blessings. Boy, you better get your Bob Cratchit looking ass out of here, man. I mean, you better go on, boy. And then he ugly, too, looking like a buzzard. You know what I'm saying? You better get your heckling, jekyll-looking ass out of here. <laughs> <laughs>
wide booty, hair falling out, teeth a mess falling out, and he know he's ugly too. He know he don't look nothing like he used to when you dealt with him. So you don't want his uh, Tavi smiley looking at. <laughs> He looking like Carl Winslow uh, removed. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody trying to cook up with you, man. Go on. You know what I'm saying? Go on somewhere. <laughs> Girl, this person is a snake. You know what I'm saying? And he's dealing with somebody else. He got somebody else that's trying to compete with you, trying to compete for his love. Girl, ain't no competition. Don't nobody want his ragged ass. Don't nobody want him but you, boo. You don't want nothing to do with him. You know what I'm saying? So look over your shoulder because this other, this little young chick he got, you know what I'm saying? He probably got kids by, she know he wants you. You know what I'm saying? And uh, she called herself competing with you. How you competing with somebody that is not competing? You for playing a game by yourself, you dumb bitch. You know what I'm saying? Something going on. You know what I'm saying? But look over your shoulder, honey, because she on one. You know what I'm saying? Girl, please. You know what I'm saying? Please. This person is a snake, y'all. Mm -hmm. This person is a snake. You don't want to deal with him, honey. You know what I'm saying? This person is a damn fool that's behind the scenes doing the spell work. You know what I'm saying? He, he ridiculous. You know, he do it behind the scenes, but he don't want to hide it. He want to hide his hands. I ain't do that. You bitch ass dude. Yes, you did. You weak punk ass. You know what I'm saying, girl? Please. You know what I'm saying? But he have faith that this connection is going to be because y'all twin flames. You know what I'm saying? He uh, may want to give you a surprise invitation or meet up with you somewhere. Um, girl, don't mess with him. Don't deal with him. Don't deal with him. Let him meet that, that girl he with. You know what I'm saying, girl? Ain't, ain't nobody trying to... Boy, go on on. Go on on with your life. You know what I'm saying? He want to hook up with you because of money, baby. This person from your past, and he's been exposed. You you know what's up with him. You know the truth about him, and you stand in your ground, so he needs to just go. You've been figured out, dude. You're like, not today. Not today. You don't want to see him. You don't want to talk to him. You don't want nothing to do with him. You're keeping your boundaries from this particular person. Go, on, man. Damn. This is somebody in your past that you want to keep in your past. Girl, this fool want to get married. This poo want to get married, uh, thinking about buying you a wedding ring. Boy, don't nobody want your wedding ring. The answer is no. So keep your money. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you're broke any damn way. So, you know, don't don't spend your last money on no ring because she don't want your ass. Trust and believe. You know what I'm saying? He broke. He busted. Uh, you rejected his ass. He trying to come stay with you. This cancer. Boy, get your... Girl, you know what I'm saying? This person is watching you, stalking you, you know what I'm saying? Stalking your home, you know what I'm saying? He feels you forced him out, you know what I'm saying? Hey, boy, don't nobody want you. Get your ass on somewhere. You can look all you want to, baby. This person is a narcissist. He's self-absorbed. If you was to be with this person, it would be a one-sided relationship. All he does is love bomb you. This person don't care about nobody. You know what I'm saying? He he cares about the, the, the best thing he could benefit from. And he see you doing good on this platform, getting this money, and here his ugly glass come looking like goddamn uh, <laughs> Lucy Lou. Boy, get your ass out of here. You know what I'm saying? Get on out of here. Ball-headed, wide booty. Your ass bigger than mine. Damn it, we lay in the bed. Where am I going to lay at? You know what I'm saying? Where am I lay at? Mattress booty ass dude. You know what I'm saying? Get on out of here. Get on out of here. Uninterested. <laughs> Rejected. <laughs> Wrong number, you know what I'm saying? Man, please, you know what I'm saying? Get out, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you dealt with this person. You had some inner child wounds to heal. Then you're not toxic no more, so you've elevated. You know what I'm saying? You, you this beautiful butterfly. You transformed them, you know what I'm saying? You ended this relationship with this person. You know what I'm saying? And you on to the next phase in your life. You know what I'm saying? You're not interested in this person. So he need to get his ravioli head ass on. It's the end. It's over. You know what I'm saying? You're not coming back. It's dead. R.I.P. So get your ass on. You know what I'm saying? This is your justice. This is your justice. I told you, you took your energy back. And now, congratulations on your platform. Congratulations on your 
of abundance and your prosperity. And um, congratulations on uh, breaking out of this bind, this bind being binded to this particular person and trying to contain you. Sorry that you have to deal with this immature person. But you high yoki empath. We laugh. You know what I'm saying? So laugh and keep your, uh, stay your ground. This person is a clown. He's a fool. And what we do, we laugh at fools. We laugh at clowns. All right? All right. Well, this is what I have for my Leo. If you feel anybody could benefit from this reading, please, please, please share the consciousness, share the awareness. Other than that, I love y'all. And as I always end it, ladies, please know thyself, know thyself, know thyself. I'll see you guys on the next reading. Y'all be easy. Bye-bye.